Um, I think it depends. If you look at something like PISA, I don't think PISA is actually a bad system for testing what it tests, but people draw too much out of it. People interpret far more than, than they should do into it. And it also tends to imply that that, that test is the be all and end all. If we're looking at trying to be the top in the test, we're not necessarily looking at being the best in learning and, and to support the students as best we can. It also means that some students are being pushed in a direction that they might be capable of, but they're not enthusiastic about, and it's not right for them, which I think is a very difficult line to draw. We've got to assess in a certain way, but I think perhaps moving a bit more towards a qualitative thing, as for example you have in a lot of the um, further education arts degrees, where it's a subjective, but it, and identifying areas for improvement, but it's not trying to make everything about the testing the be-all and end-all, it's about the process of learning and not that arbitrary endpoint.